my philosophy of life is if I do something, I want to do it 100%. I always try to be a step ahead of the others in terms of nutrition, in terms of training. Every second counts. The equipment is, is crucial today, also the sunglasses. In 1996, the Air Force approached us. We were three professors at Kent State University's Nico Crystal Institute, and they asked us to see if we can create a technology that will allow a pilot or a soldier going into a building to adapt to the different environmental conditions as fast as they can. That means that in the dark state, it needs to be like sunglass, and in the clear state, as clear as possible. It will allow a person to be able to control the amount of lights that hits them and when to hit them. I'm convinced that control will revolutionize the eyewear industry. I had them on automatic mode and I said, ah, this is not going to work. Eh? Um, but I went to a darker place where I was about to grab my glasses and take them down. Instant, I had clear lenses. If you go for an easy ride, it's nice to play a little bit dark clear in a race. It's not safe to take your hand off the bar. I would have it on automatic mode as soon as I leave the bus. It's extraordinary that this piece of equipment, designed for the US Special Forces, is available for any demanding consumer, for any athlete, for anybody who wants to enhance performance. The product can be customized in different ways. For optimal fit, you can bend the sides and the nose pad. Second of all, you can also choose the color of the frame and the color of the lens. You can take 200 cyclists and let them try this and they say this is fantastic. <laughs>